hi and good morning today is the 9th of july 2017 recently we were discussing the topic of identity with my daughter and sometimes we tend to think we have one identity like my name is no we do have multiple identities some people may think i'm a preacher because i normally post a lot of the biblical stuff on the facebook yeah but that is only one of my identities yesterday i have i had a very special identity and i was promoting lettuce and tomatoes at the barbecue i was encouraging people to have some of these as a healthy option you could have seen me i was very good at it so we have multiple identity my day job for example i'm a teacher i have a daughter so i am a mother so as you can see there are multiple there are multiple identities and psychology as well i studied psychology with the open university and when i was mapping psychology they reminded me that we do have multiple identities some of them seem like they are permanent some of them seem like they are fluid and some of them are based on what people have given us an identity like the name and others depend on what we do for a living my Bible also tells me of multiple identities and even God is given multiple names that give him multiple identity. But at the end of the day, what I have come to discover, all these identities are okay to help us in day-to-day -day activities and in day-to-day -day life. But one main identity matters and that is whose we are. And in the past week, I did discuss about something like that, about whose we are. If you know who you belong to, then that is the identity that you can come back to after all the identities. I go to work, I become a teacher there, and when I finish the day, I come back home. And yes, I am Esther even when I'm at home, but that's the name that my mother gave me. Yes, yesterday I was selling or rather promoting the lettuce at the barbecue, but... That's not what I'll be doing today. Today I'll be doing something else. Today, right now, I'm speaking to you, um, life coaching and all that, but that's not my permanent identity. At the end of the day, the day I entered this face of the earth, the person who helped me to come into this face of the earth, and it's not my biological father because he also was created by someone else. So that power behind me being born and that power behind where I will be when life says goodbye, that is what matters. Whose I am is what matters. My God matters in all things and he is my father. And that's why I wanted to say this morning, yes, we will have multiple identities in this life, but at the end of the day, whose are you? You need to know where you came from and where you are going to and that is the identity that is eternal the identity that sticks with you and if you keep on reminding yourself in day-to-day -day activities whose you are god the father then you can be able to align all the other identities alongside that because he's a good 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 father have a wonderful day today and may you find your identity, your true identity in God the Father. God bless you.